I would normally start these videos with welcome to Motivational Monday, but it's going to be a tough one today, don't you think? Um, in the UK, we've just, uh, just listened to the news that we are going into our second lockdown. And I thought hard about today's video and I thought, do we go ahead and make it or do we not? And I think maybe some of you want to listen to it. Some of you might not. Anything that I say is obviously my opinion and my feelings today, which will probably, knowing me, maybe change tomorrow, maybe different by this evening, different from this morning. And um, I just thought, let's just have a ramble and have a chat to you guys about how you're feeling and what we might be able to do to try and get through. Now, I'm going to be really honest with you in this video about my thoughts and feelings as well, but this is more about you guys. So, as always, I will say, if you feel like you're in need of professional help, that's not from me, so go elsewhere to find that and tap into the right channels. But my door is always open. If you feel there's no one else to listen to, my email address is always in the description box of my videos. Please do reach out because um, I'm a really good listener. And I've been through some stuff in my life, as most of us have as well. Now, I don't want to make this really positive and upbeat because I think a lot of us are not feeling like that. And you have to forgive me. I'm quite emotional about this one. And I'm going to also talk about, oh, I don't know. Let's just talk. Let's just me and you talk. Um, I quite like videos when people do that and you feel like there's a connection and that we're just mates having a chat. Um, I really like those. And even though they're the bigger YouTubers, sometimes I still feel like that's really, it's as if they care. And I actually really do care. So please do feel that that is a genuine offer. If you want to reach out, let's just talk. So I'm going to be honest. In the first lockdown, I was okay with it, I felt. Because I thought, oh, I had all these positive vibes about it. And the book that came out, if you've not read it, how it made us feel. And a lot of people are starting to recognise this now. It's how lockdown is making us feel. It's not necessarily what we're going through, as in we can't go out and we can't see the beauty in this and we can't meet our family and friends and stuff. But it's how it's making us feel on a personal level, isn't it? The best practical tip I can probably give you that really works for me, and this is going to sound a bit airheady or a bit... I don't know, but take your flipping vitamins, right? <laughs> so for me, I've just checked my, just double check, and I knew this already, but I double checked that my multivitamins have got vitamin D in them. Now, we're coming into winter in the UK. Um, I know loads of you are from Australia, so at least if you, you know, at least with lockdown in the summer, we had the nice weather to go out. And it's, it's a beautiful day here. You can probably see this daylight, and I'm sorry, I look so... Thing. anyway um so it's daylight oh what am i saying even we need to recognize what we feel is what we feel good vitamins will help that be kind to yourself and look after your health for obvious reasons of you know if you're going to catch the virus now this whole story about did i didn't i have it in the early part of the year and now i have made a video and i don't know if i'm going to upload it but it's me i had an antibody test and it came back negative but now they're saying, aren't they, that, you know, I'm not, not going to do the science facts, but they're saying that they're not sure if they're, if they're antibody staying your blood very long, whatever. So God knows, God only knows, like we're all sort of a little bit vulnerable right now on a physical level. And let's just take our vitamins and see if that will help, because there is so much proof. And I'm not going to quote it in the description box, but I can if you really want me to. There are so many scientific papers that say, you know, certain vitamins will trigger and help your mental health. So we're all feeling like, this is like a, a different feeling. Can you feel that like from everybody and in the air? The minute it's panic buying for Christmas, there's gonna be another announcement going out. I just heard on the radio, so I'm assuming that this is the truth, that you know they may just look at easing the measures on the 2nd of December. So we're gonna be locked down for a month and then they're gonna look at easing the measures. And so what might Christmas look like? And a lot of people are really worried about that. But I'm going to touch on something that is a little bit of a rework of something that I've just listened to online by somebody that I really respect, actually. And she said, you know, our feelings are our feelings and they're very, very valid. So for me, I'm very lucky that I've got my children here, that we really get on. We're very close, um, even though 
that they've got some work stuff going on and all that and and obviously for me i can work it doesn't really affect my work massively my offline work is minimal now compared to my online work so i'll still be working i'm still very lucky in that respect but yeah i woke up this morning with an overwhelming sadness about other things in life and we we just all feel what we feel and you feel as though oh no but there's other people that have been more sad than me or haven't got any family or aren't loved by anybody at all or ha can't get their shopping and, and don't try and think i should be okay because because if you don't feel okay you just don't feel okay you know and it's all right to feel like that that is your emotion that is your feeling of how you're feeling and as long as it's not like I don't, oh, I don't know I don't know what to say really about that but we're feeling like in my book the first one there's going to be a second one to come and this is going to make some excellent material I'm hoping to get a little bit of writing done today um because it's important to get this emotion that I've got in me today into that second book for history purposes and for other people to feel that when they read it that they connect um, now, the first one was um, a real mix of authors, I'm sorry, a real mix of authors and we was all very much um, like, actually this is okay. And writing about it really helped with um, some of those who had written, and they didn't really make any secret about it, some of those who had written were people that were dealing a little bit with anxiety and mental health stuff. And they found that writing it really helped them. So part of me is thinking about, do we do another one so that it's helping people? You know, do you want to get something down on paper and contribute? Let's just do that. <laughs> Let's just get them out of the way. Um, but that book, and like mine started then, and my half, that I wrote half of that book, it, it finished um, in the middle of May. And I've continued to write sporadically between now and then. And it's been like this, like this, like this. And I feel at the minute we're all going downhill roller coaster what the heck's going on how are we going to deal with it you know do you feel sad <sighs> it's where is the positive in this there are some and i think we should try and look for them but also in the same stiff upper lip kind of british come on we've got this i don't know what i'm saying um I know that if I didn't put anything up, you guys would be like, where is she? Why has she not put something up? But to try and just, it doesn't feel right to make this all about positive thinking and all about, let's look at the glass half full because I think so many of us are not feeling that and I feel it would be a little bit derogatory almost to say that. You didn't come to this channel for negativity, but you, you, maybe also like the realism side of things and you know you know that i have changed my life since 2009 by using the law of attraction and the positivity but just today i feel sad i feel that what is going on with the world what is happening why can we not get you know i know the i know the reasons and i know the answers why we can't get a hold of things why we can't make things better overnight um but people's mental health is really struggling at the moment. Now, what is the answer to that? Like I said, I don't know. I, I, it's going to be different for everybody. What do you think is yours? What do you think you need? Um, do you need um, to be kind to yourself in the way of making nice dinners in the hot pot or watching films on the television? Like today... The work that I had planned for today, because Jasmine and I have been away, um, and the work I had planned for today, I really, really don't feel like doing. And I can do it tomorrow. So I'm going to do that tomorrow. And today I'm going to do different things because that's what I feel that I want to do to try and sort this out a little bit. Now, um, okay, I'm really sorry that I'm emotional, but you've seen me emotional here before. And I, I don't, you know, being positive is the one thing. And being open enough to share this with you is another thing and maybe i shouldn't but we're this far into the video now if you're still watching you're one of you're one of my tribe that knows what i'm like by now and um i just want to make 
things better for you and I don't know how to do that so maybe that's partly my frustration because a lot of the time I get these messages of like say I really related to your video and I really relate to what you said and it really made me feel so much better and I love that that's almost like my thing and um god almighty this is terrible um and I can't I don't feel like I've got the tools today to do that um what I mm, Maybe I'll make another video. Maybe I'll start to do some of these morning ones like I did at the beginning of the first lockdown because you guys did seem to really enjoy that. And even though it only had a small audience of about 50 of you, you seem to get quite a bit out of that. And thoughts and feelings of the day and what are we going to do today and how can we tap into something nice or, um, you know, what is the, the thing? I just... <sighs> like last time it was... it wasn't easy but I found so much joy in it and I haven't got that joy now and I don't know about you but I, this is the feeling that I'm getting from the kind of planet but it's not is it because it's different everywhere and like we we're in a state stage of um like Jasmine's just been called it to work because it's so so busy everyone's like Christmas you know let's get it all done and everyone laughed at me I showed you all my Christmas presents and wrapping up and and like everyone was like oh you know, and I did it and I've done it and thank God <laughs> we haven't got a tree or anything, but I think that will come quite early this year. I just want you to be kind to yourselves. Like, what do you think that you need at that point in time? Try, if you can, to give yourself that thing. Um, I'm a little bit lost for words and it isn't as bad as I'm sitting here feeling today. There's so many other things in that mix and I'm probably a little bit tired because we had quite a um, a fun filled, busy, busy, busy weekend and it was really, really nice. And also that was quite emotional. Um, there, I, I did vlog that and I'm gonna try and edit and get up so many videos for you guys, which is gonna be really nice because this channel is probably the way forward for me in terms of my online stuff and um, so yeah, so I vlogged it, so I will be sharing that with you. But maybe I'm a little bit tired. I also had a glass of wine yesterday, and that always seems to put me on a bit of a come down. And, you know, missing people that you're not going to be able to see, and even, you know, picking up my laptop and going and doing my writing in the coffee shop is a thing that just fills me up, and I like that. And we're not going to be able to do those things for a little while, and it's, it is what it is, isn't it? Um... But like I say, the main thing, the main takeaway from this this video that I want you to be kind to yourself and give yourself what it is that you feel you need to feel, I don't know, it's not to feel better, is it? It's to, it's not about feeling better, it's about just not beating yourself up for feeling whatever you're feeling because that is a true emotion and that's a true feeling. Um, and I think that's probably what the title of this video is gonna be, is, you know, you are feeling what you're feeling and just, you know, don't don't be like, oh, I should be more positive because, you know, especially as you're here watching this and I, that is what I try and coach you with on this channel and I love that. 90% of the time, that's what we're gonna be talking about. Other times we're gonna be talking about that was really difficult to do because, and at the moment it's really difficult to do because of so many eclectic reasons. And I think this video is probably long enough for this. Um, I also <laughs> need to tell everybody that their holidays have been canceled and the Tui video needs an update and that's gonna be a tough one to do as well. And I look so much like I've been crying. So how the hell am I gonna make that video? But anyway, I do wish the best for you. I do really want to somehow offer some sort of service other than just like main boxes open. I actually want to do something concrete um, that's going to be really super accessible for everybody. Um, but I don't know what that is yet and I haven't worked it out. If that's something that you think that you might want to tap into, then let me know. Um, maybe it's in exchange for, oh, I don't know. I really don't know, um, but I want to make it so that, you know, if you're someone that needs to talk and I've got these big old good shoulders, 
you know to feel that you can because I feel as though maybe that's the way forwards is that all being there for each other sort of thing do you know what I mean I don't know anyway it's long enough of just me rabbiting on but I did didn't feel it was the right thing to come on today and go hello welcome to my special Monday when some of you are going to be feeling quite low um I think a lot of people are feeling it and myself included and we will get through but I think putting that positive slant on this video would be the wrong thing to do because it's quite massive for quite a lot of us so I'm sending lots of love to you and um, please know that that's genuine you know it's a genuine thing and um, I hope you're going to be um, as okay as you can be and let's just all I don't know I don't I don't know what the words are I'm really sorry it's escaping me today um, but we will we will be okay we know that don't we is this a bit too negative i'm sorry if it is because it's just you know anyway that's how they put well kitchen roll you think we could do better than that right anyway we're gonna be fine but just yeah don't don't be just be kind to yourself okay and um lots of love from me and i'll see you really soon i'm gonna do so many videos and it's gonna be you'll be like for god's sake will she bugger off i'm sick of her no, not really but anyway Take care and mwah, lots of love to all of yous. And um, we got this right. We can do it. We can.